Welcome back, Stranglers. When we last left off, we were going to Sector, I believe it was 180. And um, people were shooting purple RPGs at us. So we're in a helicopter. But we have a gun, so it doesn't really matter. Because um, you know how it works. When, you, when you've got a big fatty gun, you, 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 you can just do some stuff that uh, couldn't normally be done. Like, for example, you see that right there? Yeah, we're, we're going to go ahead and just blow the crap out of that. And just because we can't, we're going to get a little bit cocky here. We're going to wait until the end of our Chiquita time is up. Oh, mm-hmm. What's that? What's that little, like, what's that little, like, beacon thingy that was going on? Oh, gosh, dude. A little bit more steady would be much appreciated, my friends, okay? You can just kind of, like, hold that. Ah, uh, no. Gotta shoot that guy. We're doing good? To your right. To my right. Where? What? Oh. Oh gosh. Come on. Oh man, that was fun. What is that? It keeps glowing blue and I want to see what it is. Why do these guys keep running out here with like a, the guys with assault rifles against the helicopter? I understand the guys who have RPGs. 360, okay. That's understandable, RPGs. But if you're gonna come out here with like an assault rifle, I mean, I don't know, I guess in real life an assault rifle against a helicopter at this range would be effective enough. So I take that back. This is just a video game and it's suspending reality to make gameplay more fun. So I take back my little rant. We are, we are, we are pretty dang close, so. Yeah. In the face hole, baby. Turning to vector 180. We're going back to 180. There we go. That'll, that'll do that. Just being proactive, blowing stuff up while we're waiting. This guy has like three things that he that are in his um that are in his vocabulary. Total. Where are you? On a helicopter? And losing my temper. Hang in there. You gotta try and stop the golden cane from moving weapons and drugs through the flotilla. It's time to sink some boats. Get that chopper for some hole mines. Sink the boat. Sink some boats, I like that. Look at the red boats spewing black smoke tequila. These are your targets. Once aboard, plant the bomb on the mark green location. That's what that was. Great, we gotta look for more black smoke. We all know how bad I suck at this. So. We'll see. We will see what happens. Um, okay, that's that's the first boat that I'm gonna go to is that one over there Come on, baby I'm just gonna run over there <laughs> Damn, no, 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 okay Oh, so this is the boat that we want right okay, I guess let's go below deck what gun is that? I want to know what gun that was. It had a laser on it. Lasers are pretty. Um, there, there's a spot. Oh, we got a couple of things to take care of first, apparently. Sweet, that was easy. All right. Who's up? Who's up next? Mm. All right. And stuff getting blown up is always a good thing in my book. In my book, I almost said in my boat. That thing sunk extremely quickly. Oh man. Okay. And now I have three enemy vessels to sink. 
let's see what the uh, let's get up to some higher 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 ground or higher boat or whatever you want to call it. But uh, let's get up there so that we can uh, you know see where the smoke's coming from. Okay, I'm going to just uh, oh. We got that one, that one, and that one. So let's do this one since I'm already over here. How do I get over to that thing? Seriously, how do I get over to that? I'm... I don't... I don't understand how to get over to that thing. Seriously, this is beyond my IQ to figure out. Okay, oh. We'll go to these docks over here. I guess. I don't know. How do I get down there? Oh, I don't like figuring this stuff. No, I wanted to get onto here. Still, still no, but whatever. So, so how do I get to that dock over there? What? What am I doing? Let's try going to like the top of this. Maybe there's a zip line or something that I didn't see. I thought that was a crane. That's just a light bulb. So, oh, yep, there is a zip line. That's what I was missing. All right, let's see who all wants some. Is there seriously nobody here who wants some? Oh man, I love zipline shooting people. That's a bummer. Well, since we're gonna go ahead and be in this boat, let's pop out a shotgun just for uh, just for just for fun. Um, how do I get off of the boat now? Okay, I know, I know. Don't blow up yet. Give it a little bit of time before you blow up boat. Okay. There you go. There you go. That's a good boat. Oh, man. Oh, it's so good. Sorry, I'm adjusting myself in my chair here. Oh, man. Let's do this. Yet again, those boats sink extremely quickly. I will say that. So those are the two that we got left. I guess we'll try to get to this one first. See, see what happens, baby. All right. Alrighty then, well here's the boat, so... The shotguns are very useful inside boats. Never actually looked to see where the bomb marker thingy was. I don't even know what level it's on. Yeah, see it's right here. Uh, top deck. Get out of here. Sweet. Okay, one left, baby. Whew, one more to go. But I got it. But I gotta take a phone call real quick. We need paramedics and uniforms out at the patilla now. Did someone promote you to captain? I said I wanted you back at HQ. Make the call. Fire me later. I've got a boat to board and search. What boat? What are you doing? Got the lead on Jimmy Wong, and I want to know if he is behind this war. I told you to stay the hell away from this investigation. If you don't you start listening up. to me, to Try get it out. Later. <laughs> He's sassy. Okay, uh, where's that last enemy, Vassell? It's over here. Trying not to lose my sense of direction. 
navigating through all of these various boats and such. really supposed to go down with the ship, but, um, you know, I think I'm just gonna make it so that you all do, just so you can kind of, you know, feel more at ease with your captain. Yeah, like that. There you go. That'll, uh, I think that'll help you out. I really do. Oh, and, uh, since I'm such a nice guy and all. Alright. And we just calmly, like, row, row, row away on the boat. Oh, yeah, you know. Whatever. Whatever work. Now we're on a cruise ship. Oh, the King James. <laughs> Alright. Pretty nice boat. I won't lie. Oh, man. Oh, there. Yep. There's. there's dude, turn around. There's a guy with, with a gun. to have a street address. Don't make a fat joke, son. It's a thyroid condition. The name is Tom Hall. Sit. You got bad history. I know. Then why are you trying to kill me? If I wanted you dead, you already would be. Today, I need your help. <laughs> There's a look I haven't seen on your face a lot. Confusion. Let me clear it up for you. The Golden Cane put out the hit on your cop, not Dragonclaw. They made it look like me by leaving my I-9 crew's signature. Ah, I guess all is forgiven. Don't be a smart ass. I ain't looking for a hug from no cop. Are you gonna listen or mouth off? I'll smoke. You don't. Young Gee's Golden Cane partnered up with a Russian crew out of Chicago. Damon Zakharov and his boys. They want Hong Kong. My territory. Take them out. You've got the muscle. Yes. I got the guns and muscle. But the Zakharovs have... them. Hmm. So Billy Danger, Tico. After you, Zakharov took him from a house in Chicago two weeks ago. How come you haven't sent anyone to chop them into pieces and bring Billy and Tico home? If I send a crew out of Hong Kong, red flags go up all over. The FBI would be waiting at the airport. And Zakharov made it real clear that if I move against Golden Cane, Billy and Tico die. So I've got to send someone good. Someone clean, someone the cops won't watch, and someone who cares enough about the outcome to die getting it done. It's gotta be you. You are the one who took them away from me. I never even held Tico in my arms, and I haven't heard from Billy since 18 years. Not a phone call, not a postcard. I told her not to. She was afraid of me then. By the time we made up, she was afraid you wouldn't forgive her. You know how many times I thought of killing you? <laughs> Probably lots. And you've got the guts to ask me to bring them back for you? How do you live with yourself? I'm used to me.
can't be caught mixed up in this. Don't let them take the hangar. Oh, jeez. So it looks like. Guess we're partners again. Huh. Didn't know you were deep Hold on. In fracking There's lots you don't know. Right now, we've got to blow this place to hell. Did you find the C4? I don't think Wong will like that. Either we turn it into matchsticks, or Golden Cane takes off with a thousand kilos of heroin. I got the spots marked inside where you need to place the charges. Oh, good to know you are still on our side. Once a partner, always a partner, right? Get it done, and a police boat will pick you up at the dock. Man. Alright, so I'm about to go play some C4 charges. I'm going to do that in the next episode, however. Uh, but what it looks like is uh, I was... I porked that dude's daughter... Had a kid, but then they were like, he was like, since I'm a crime dude, and you, and he's a police officer, you can't see him, sent him away. I haven't seen my daughter, ever, and I haven't seen the chick that I porked, or I'm assuming I kind of liked, um, in 18 years, it looks like. So, um, now I'm gonna go get him back. So, the plot thickens. Sorry that this episode ran a little bit long, but you know what? It's all worth it for that awesomeness story. So, tune in next episode to see what happens.